Good evening. You're watching Hungary Reports from Public Media M1. I'm Orsia Fum. Thanks for joining us. While earlier experts believed that the coronavirus was not dangerous for children, it has proven to be no longer the case and there is also proof that the virus often causes serious complications. It is therefore very important for younger age groups to receive the vaccination as soon as possible, President of the Hungarian Pediatric Association said in an interview on Kossuth Radio. Laszlo Gádos emphasized that the virus couldn't be curbed with that vaccinations and that the vaccines available in Hungary were safe. Pediatricians, I think, are the most committed to vaccination, and they see that neither in the short nor in the long run, children do not develop such side effects from vaccines, which make it worth refusing the inoculation. The effectiveness of COVID-19 vaccines and their side effects cannot be compared, I believe. 80% of young people between the ages of 16 and 18 have already registered to receive a jab. Chief Medical Officer Tatilia Muller announced, adding that they had decided to make it possible for the approximately 6,000 young people to schedule an appointment to get vaccinated, even though they had registered last Saturday and Sunday, just after the Friday deadline. One of the world's largest plants manufacturing concrete roofing tiles will be built in Hajdu Soboslo. Minister of Foreign Affairs and Trade announced. Peter Siarton noted that the capacity of the factory would reach about 220,000 tons per year, adding that the tiles would be manufactured exclusively from organic materials. Therefore, the products would be 100% recyclable. Austrian construction material manufacturer Leyer is investing more than 18 million euros in its developments in Hajdu Soboslo. Was low pitch and Diano Schaza, the minister emphasized. The European Union has no other choice, but it should speed up its integration process with Montenegro by setting clear criteria and deadlines and holding effective negotiations, President of Hungary said after talks with Montenegrin President in Budapest on Tuesday. Janusz Hada noted that the EU had only concluded three chapters in its accession talks with Montenegro out of the 33 ones opened in the last four years, adding that, I quote, this cannot be called progress and effective negotiation even under the most favorable interpretation. Montenegro has already proven its capabilities and commitment as a NATO member, the president emphasized. And that's all for now, but we'll be back tomorrow night at around the same time and you can catch Hungary reports online as well. Please stay tuned for our other news in German, Russian and Chinese. Thanks for watching. Take care. Good night.